hello friends welcome back to this new episode and in this episode we will build our all categories section so basically on our home page we will show our all categories so guys let's get started and before starting this uh, series if you are new on my channel please make sure you have subscribed the channel and uh, like this video okay so guys uh, let's uh, go back to our component directory and here i am going to create um, another folder name it uh, categories and then inside the categories folder i am going to create three files one for all categories and one for categories card and another for category css so guys let's just create those files Okay, uh, I have created the three files. So let's uh, uh, go to our all categories and write RAFC. So it will create an arrow function. Then go to the category card. Do the same as RAFC. So it uh, creates our uh, component as the arrow function. Okay, so uh, inside our card category CSS, I'm going to just a uh, copy few lines of css so here uh, there is a class custom card and it's height 100 percent background color white and box shadow and border none text align center font size 20 pixel and font weight 500 okay so this is very basic css you can pause this video here and uh, write the code okay or you can get the source code from my repository no worries so let's uh, go back to our category card and create our category card first of all um, uh, i'm going to return a link type a link so basically react router dom link so here uh, import and remove the space extra space and inside the link category because each card would be a link so that we can navigate to another category so this link has a path so let's say two and say category slash uh, it should be a dynamic so i can say category okay so uh, we are going to pass as a props here so category so we'll take these props from our all categories and uh, uh, category slash category name and then we will navigate to the array so here i'm going to add some css class uh, class name it's from bootstrap so text decoration none and uh, text is uh, dark or black okay. and inside the link i'm going to create a card so which is from react bootstrap and then uh, inside the card uh, i am taking a card body so card dot body okay and inside the body uh, i'm taking a card text card dot text uh, in card text i'm just going to pass our category name so as we get our props so just say category and let's uh, add some css here so class name would be text capitalize this is all about our uh, uh, card design okay so now let's uh, uh, took this card into our all category space so here is our all categories and actually all categories would be a list of categories or there should be a map so so there i'm just going to start a container so which is from react bootstrap the container and inside the container i'm going to have a title so taking a h3 element and let's say browse categories and this h3 i'm going to give some uh, class property bootstrap class class name this is uh, text the center and margin bottom four so we are giving a header to this class element this class element is going to uh, print a few more rows uh, one row in few more columns so for that i'm going to take a bootstrap row 
and inside the row i'm going to check a column so let's input bootstrap column and here i'm going to um, define extra small so how many columns it should show so on extra small it will show one column and on small it will say two columns so that's why each column is six and medium it will take uh, three space so it will show four and i'm going to give some class name this is um, md2 margin bottom 2 and padding 2 okay and okay this uh, that's all and inside here so inside the column i am going to call our cut category sorry category card so say category card and here i'm just going to pass category as a props so initially let's say uh, men's clothes okay so we have uh, done on this uh, ca all categories card design i think so let's uh, go back to our home page and uh, import uh, all categories underneath the header slider so say all categories and then slash okay so all categories has been mm, uh, Im imported in our home page so let's go back to our browser and check that uh, we are getting all categories or not sister so refresh it yeah you can see that we are getting our all categories here you can see men clothes but sometimes since the design has been broken so let's uh, go back to our code and let's uh, fix this uh, header slider section so go back to our header slider and we are having some issue here on header slider just no it's okay because we are having issue with our max site okay uh, so right now in our bottom we need some space okay so i'm just to remove the max site and that is the problem we are having so in our home page let's uh, add some space here uh, md5 db5 okay so just adding some space just copy this part okay and uh, s two times this is uh, pseudo dive uh, we will remove this uh, div uh, at the end uh, because uh, our footer is fixed so that's why it's uh, overlapping with our content so let's uh, refresh it and uh, yeah now we have enough space here so right now you can see that in our browse category section we are having one categories men's clothes so actually this would be dynamic so we are not dealing with dynamic data right now so guys so we will check it out later okay so just uh, now the basic implementation about the card categories yeah so that's all for this video tutorial guys and see you on next video